Breaking news tonight, two firefighters heard battling a fire in Hartford. Hi everybody, I'm Ann Craig. And I'm Darren Kramer, glad you're with us tonight. The crews are still working to put that fire out right now. It's happening in a building on Hamilton Street. News 8's Bob Wilson is live there tonight. And Bob, what's the latest? Well, we have two firefighters injured. They were carried away on stretchers, but we're told the good news is that they are in a pretty good condition. There are minor injuries, but take a look at the fire. It's a uh, really going up. It's a three-story building, but it's got six apartments in it. And uh, we we're told the firefighters were trying to help put out that fire where one turned an ankle. We don't know whether it's just sprained or broken. And the other, another one got hit in the jaw by a tool and also taken to the hospital to be checked out. Minor injuries at this point. Now we're told that the building is uh, abandoned, unoccupied. There are two different things that, that there is renovations going on inside. So they believe that the uh, owner of the building was trying to put it back into uh, usable shape. But neighbors say they just smelled smoke, heard the crackling of the fire, saw the flames ran out and called 911. Yeah, it was a lot of fire. You could see it was all red coming out and it was getting close to my building. It's almost getting my building. <clears throat> now, there was one firefighter injured in a fire last week in an abandoned building. They're still looking at the cause and origin of that fire. Fire investigators are still trying to get at this fire. They still have to put it out. They say it'll go well into the early morning hours. I'm Bob Wilson reporting live in Hartford, News 8.